Hi, this is a video on the Elegant Selfie Stick Tripod Mini. Now this is a extendable tripod uh, selfie stick for your mobile phone. And I bought this from Amazon for £11.99. And at the present moment, there is a voucher on there for 10% off when you purchase this. Uh, we'll go around the box. And as you can see, it has elegant written at the top. I hope I pronounced that right. A picture of the selfie stick at its lowest level uh, with its legs out. A picture of the selfie stick folded up. It says here wireless selfie stick. And it says at the bottom, capture your every perfect moment and and we got here the actual model number we turn around and on this side it has the specifications now it's got here the mount holder holds between 3 to 4.2 inches or 75 to or 75 to 110 millimeters the shortening length of this is three sorry is 7.3 inches or 186 millimeters the extended length is 27.5 inches or 700 millimeters the camera angle is 200 degrees adjustable it is powered by a replacement CR1632 coin cell battery. The phone system can go on any Android of 4.2.2 and above and OS of 5.0 and above. So that's the specifications there. Sorry about that sticker, that's an Amazon sticker, but this is the actual how it looks. And then on the side here, it's got here wireless stainless steel um, rotates, rotatable clip and angle adjustment on there and back to the front. Now I'll open it up. Inside the box, we get a, first of all, we get a simple user's manual here. Uh, which we get and it is in English and we get a QR code on the back uh, to their website and to their Facebook uh, page so that's what we get next we get a bag uh, which is made out of a kind of nylon uh, with drawstrings at the top uh, with plastic ends here and that's for obviously to put the selfie stick in and we get a spare CR1632 coin cell battery so that's a spare one that you get you do actually get one um, with the unit so this is a spare that you get and this is the actual um, selfie stick tripod now as you can see um, it folds in on itself and it is just about 7.2 inches in length we and I'll go through it now we have a nice ergonomic I'll give it that it's a nice ergonomic handle which also doubles up as the tripod legs we have here the shutter button which is Bluetooth and that's what the coin cell battery goes into and as I said you get a one in there already and we have the phone mount now the phone mount here has a clickable adjustment here there is no screw here which is a bit of a shame um, because there's no screw actually in there if there is a screw it is hidden 
in there but there's no thumb screw for adjustment what you get is a click into place for the adjustment and the phone holder is the same we have click adjustments for the phone holder it is spring loaded as you can see spring loaded we have rubber here and rubber at the top here we have the words elegant written on the back as you can see now this part here feels like metal but my guess is that it is plastic I'll extend it out but it feels like a kind of metal it probably let me test I am sorry about that it is metal so this part here is metal and this is the bottom of the stem the bottom of the feet do not have rubber ends on there which is a shame because they're not rubber ends this around here feels like uh, a rubber but there's no rubber ends on the bottom of the feet here now I'll extend it out a little bit just to show you the shutter button which comes out here and this is the shutter button that's how it looks now the shutter button connects to your phone um, to your Bluetooth now for your phone whether you got iOS um, an Apple phone or a Samsung phone that runs Android it doesn't have to be a Samsung phone but any Android phone or iOS phone such as this you need to go to the settings on either phone either um, operating system go into Bluetooth then go in then as you go into Bluetooth for iOS users you simply look for other devices and you press this for a couple of uh, seconds while the blue light flashes that will put this into pairing mode on Android users you do you have to go into as I said settings then Bluetooth um, some Android phones will ask um, to see other Bluetooth devices so you have to press yes to look for other Bluetooth devices and the same principle applies you hold down on the shutter button here and you'll get a blue and you get a blue light that flashes once that flashes it will you click on it it will come up as selfie com so it will come up as selfie com I'll show you here it will come up there it is there it will come up as selfie com you touch on that now it will connect now if it asks for a password to connect because sometimes it probably will do um, depends on uh, your Android device you simply type in four zeros or one two three four and that will connect this but you can always refer back to the manual here and it will tell you the number so it can be either four zeros or one two three four and that will be the pair now that is that only goes for uh, Android users and even then it depends on what Android operating system that you got so bear that in mind and once that is connected that's it this is your now your shutter for your camera now this is how the selfie stick tripod from elegant looks when it's fully extended right now when it says an overall length I think it was 27.5 is the overall length now that is from the bottom to the top here but when it comes to these selfie sticks and selfie sticks tripods I don't go by that measurement because your hand is going to take up some of that measurement anyway on the handle 
and the phone takes up some of that measurement there as well so I don't really go by that so I literally go by between the end of the handle or the top of the handle to the end of the phone mount now between these two points here it is 16 centimeter 16 sorry 16 inches long so it's 16 inches long between those two points and that's how far the stem comes out now the stem is stainless steel stem and it does the same basis of a old-fashioned car aerial so there's no twist to lock it into place it uses friction to keep itself locked into place now down the middle of the um, extension the rod here the stem we have a seam we only have one seam which is running all the way down and it is at the front so it's only one seam and as I says um, about with this um, selfie stick tripod you can have it in I'll just do it that way you can have it in a landscape or you can turn it but you remember you have to adjust the phone slightly move the phone up and you can that's it have it in portrait now you can have the angle of it as I said it's a click in a handle uh, click in mount to click it into into a position which isn't too bad I'll give it that it's not too bad it all depends on this clicking system up here how long that will last and um, before it starts to wear down because obviously it sounds like it's plastic clicking into plastic which is up here but uh, one thing they could have done was put a thumb screw here which would be even brilliant more better and you can tighten it into position which is more longer lasting than having this click system but it is a click system and I can't complain about that and we'll see if I'll put it back into um, landscape now I'm, we're gonna see now if and straighten it we're gonna see now if the shutter button here <laughs> I just sent it off just now now we're just gonna see if the shutter button here actually makes the sound here because some shutter buttons and some selfie sticks mute the sound so we we'll see if that mutes the sound and it works and as you can see you could hear it it takes the picture and we'll and that's just me there and we'll do a video to see if the same thing happens with the video we got the sound for on and the sound for off so that does not mute the sound and now we got the actual uh, holder here and as you can see for the hole that that fits in there and that just slides in now I have to say this be careful when you're using shutter buttons like these and you have to take them out because this is very very small and easy to lose because there there is no lanyard hook um, hole on this so you could lose it so be be aware of that so next I'm going to show you now how it would look when it's floor standing now this is how the elegant um, selfie stick tripod looks like when it's um, floor standing and as you can see here it's not a very tall um, floor standing um, selfie stick tripod this to me is not so much um, for outdoor use as a when it, the feet is out because it has a very very small footprint I mean really small my hand is probably bigger than the actual footprint of the legs on the ground here so to me 
for outside use this is not a tripod self stick tripod for outside use if you're going to have it like this um, only on days where it's going to be no absolutely no wind no breeze and even then it is only suitable to place on a table or on a chair and and even then you or a bench it is suitable for that but for floor standing absolutely uh, not it's not suitable for that but to put it on a desk a table a work surface um, the length of it the height of it and that it is quite all right for that I give it that um, uh, I give it that it um, bear in mind the bottom as I says again the bottom of the feet have got no rubber on there so it is resting on plastic but this is really a tripod basically suited tripod selfie stick and um, basically suited when in this uh, position is suited for out, uh, indoor use only not for outdoor if you're taking it outdoors fine as a selfie stick but for, as a tripod not worth it to be outdoors now this is my two pence worth on this uh, selfie stick tripod by elegant and I hope I got that right right as an overall tripod selfie stick it's all right I'll give this a six out of ten it is all right if you're going on holiday for its price it's worth buying now a thing I've got to say about that is if you're going on holiday and most of your holiday is consistent of going into um, historical buildings um, museums art galleries etc along those lines cathedrals along those lines it's going into historical buildings this is not a bad selfie stick tripod to take because this is really suitable for indoor use when the legs are out it's really suitable for that because it can be placed on tabletops um, chairs if you want to put it on a chair it's suitable for that or a bench it's suitable for that for out if your trip is mainly outdoors you're gonna spend a lot of time outdoors then it's half and half I'd say because it has a good ergonomic handle the length ain't too bad if you're looking for something compact the length ain't too bad so if you trips are mainly outdoors you can use this as a selfie stick but I would not use it as a tripod selfie stick for outdoors because the slightest breeze will blow this over just the tiniest of breeze will blow this over because as I says when the legs are spread the base of it the area it takes up is not very big so I wouldn't use it as a tripod outdoors how my negatives about this a couple of negatives I'll start off with the feet I like the kind of grippiness of the handle and the kind of feel of the rubber on the handle but on the bottom for some reason it's plastic not rubber it, you don't get that kind of rubber feeling on the bottom so that's a negative there another negative is the shutter button here it is very small and very flat and easy to lose so bear that in mind personally I would not take this shutter button out unless you're indoors <laughs> and you're not amongst a lot of people because if it drops at least you can find it but otherwise than that it's a very small shutter button here so that's another negative um, another another negative is the mounting point here for the phone mount it's clickable which is good but because this is plastic touching plastic basically plastic against plastic to get that click there be aware 
you might not you might get limited usage out of this because if you keep doing that eventually this will wear down so and there'll be no way of tightening that back up I think there is a screw in there but who walks with the screwdriver so that could have been a thumb screw and that would have been even great so be aware of that so them are the only negatives which I can find with this which I can really stand out negatives with this selfie stick tripod by elegant but otherwise I would say it's a very good selfie stick tripod for the price a very selfish good a very good selfie stick tripod if you're going abroad to take it is very good just bear them things in mind what I said and um, I have to say it's nice and compact and for the fellas out there yes it is a man's kind of selfie stick tripod uh, so it is a it, you won't look feminine in this and women you'd look all right believe me because uh, my missus she kind of likes this one now that's my video of the selfie stick tripod by elegant as i said you can pick this up for just under 12 pounds and there's a 10 percent discount voucher through amazon uh, when you pick this up um, when you order it so be aware of that now if you've got this particular selfie stick tripod please let us know down in the comments section what you think to what you thought of it um, how long you've had it and is it still going so let us know and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you don't like this video give it a thumbs down all the same thanks for watching